the 27th of the 1st, 2014. This is your radioactive reality. Hi, Jen. Your mom said you were watching. Any news? Uh, after seeing that map with massive amount of nuclear waste headed to the west coast, there's going to be impacts. Radioactive water still hasn't stopped flowing from Fukushima into the Pacific. We've been telling you over and over again, you know, over 300 million metric tons every day going out of Fukushima and directly into the Pacific Ocean. Reports, white goo everywhere in Alaska seal. Crows won't touch it, yet they eat people's roofs. Slime in one's mouth, kidney almost black. Another appeared to change color. Hairless one seen recently. We're, we all have six seals here, and uh, they're saying it's connected to the Fukushima radiation. Uh, apparently all that radiation got trapped up in the snow, and then when that snow melted, went downstream, it affects all the way down the line, and this stuff accumulates. Um, this has more to do than just bananas. Highly radioactive groundwater now flowing under unit number one. Level skyrocket since last test. Always skyrocketing, isn't it? Now thousands of times higher. Eight locations hit records in recent days at Fukushima Diachi. 1,053. Every day. Just gets worse and worse, don't it? Historical weirdness. Historical weirdness. Expert says U.S. government has failed public by not testing the Pacific for radiation. A very obvi obvious need since Fukushima is leaking into the ocean. They told me, it's salty and that's not our thing. This is how all our different alphabet soup agencies are ignoring this issue or flat out lying and helping perceive the lie. Uh, as reported in released NRC documents. This is insane. Underground holes may be needed to search for Fukushima 3 molten cores. We don't know where it is. Cold shutdown. It's cold shutdown. Did fuel escape via basement?